People joke about the idea that robots are taking over. Well, it's not fiction for part of the city parks department that's added a couple of machines to help maintain some sports fields. News 13's Jessica Salinas has a look. The newest addition to the city's park and recreation department is hard at work, striping away at the newly remodeled Los Altos softball park near Eubank and Lomas. So far, it's uh, it's really outshined itself uh, and uh, proven its worth. The city says two of these newly turf robots will help save time and money. In all, throughout the whole season, it costs us just in labor alone about $34,000 per year to mark these fields. The robots are on lease to the city for at least the next year, costing $16,000, which covers maintenance and repairs. For now, they're only being used at Los Altos Park, where the city says the robots should be a big help, covering now five softball fields. It's honestly pretty fun to drive around. It's like a big remote control car. <laughs> The work is also much faster now. Two robots can paint a field in as quick as 10 minutes, compared to two people taking over half an hour if they're not busy with something else. Manpower is not always uh, readily available, but in order to uh, really bring these to that next level, we need to have uh, assistance. So far, the robots are only painting softball fields, but the city says there's a possibility of using them elsewhere. Our goal is Isotopes Level uh, Premier Facility, so in order to maintain that, we need as much help as we can get. Jessica Salinas, KRQE News 13. Stay tuned because City Park says it is considering naming the robots possibly through an online contest, but they haven't finalized a plan yet.